Players came back uh, really well. Uh, we put in a lot of hard work uh, last uh, spring and uh, we emphasized uh, conditioning, we em emphasized being fit. And it's uh, very clear that the team did a lot of work off the field. Um, I know the majority of them spent their summers away doing internships, had, uh, had jobs. But um, as far as we um, are right now, I can definitely tell that they've put in a lot of work extra just to make sure that they uh, came in fit and, and ready to start season number two after the change last year. Um, I think there's a very healthy excitement in the team and I think that has um, pushed everybody just harder and um, making sure that they get ready for what is uh, about to start in a few days. I think this team uh, really depends on, on teamwork and I know that uh, might sound as a cliche but it, uh, it really is the case in our situation if uh, one of us doesn't step up on a given day there's, uh, there's enough people that can uh, take the responsibilities and take roles. Um, we have a couple of tremendous players. Um, um, Eli Jacobson is, is fit again uh, after surgery last January. We expect a lot from her this year. Um, we have uh, all Ivy League player uh, Caitlin Ray, who is going to be very important for us in the midfield. But uh, as I said, it, it's, it, it really is going to be um, how much work the whole entire team is going to put on the field on any given day. Yeah, I think we have a great schedule. We have uh, a couple of uh, like uh, top 10, top 15. Uh, programs from last year and uh, that's going to really tell us where we are with Harvard Field Hockey. We uh, have a couple of uh, the typical play the teams that we play against um, that uh, are in the area. Uh, we had a couple of very close losses against the majority of the teams last year and uh, for that reason alone I, I, I planned um, to have the same amount of teams or same teams again this year just to make sure that we see the progression and I, I feel very confident that we will be more successful, that we actually will uh, play a few teams that we uh, had a hard time against last year that will play uh, more confident and more comfortable this year. Uh, hopefully we'll be able to do that uh, well enough that we can win. And then of course we have a very um, uh, competitive Ivy League schedule where uh, Princeton will definitely be the team to beat. Um, we have uh, Cornell, we have Yale, um, teams that will come out and make sure that they uh, showed up their um, dominance over the last couple of years in the Ivy League and I, uh, I think we made the right adjustments and made the right steps in order to compete with those teams for um, a top position in the Ivy League.